Let's make buffalo chicken enchiladas. Grab a 9 by 13 casserole dish, coat it with nonstick spray. Now we're gonna melt two tablespoons of butter. You can do this in the microwave, on the stove top, whatever you prefer. We're gonna use the KitchenAid mixer to shred our already cooked chicken. Rotisserie chicken would also be great for this. I cooked my chicken in a skillet on the stove top in some olive oil and I seasoned with my everyday seasoning blend which is salt, pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, paprika, and oregano, but you season however you like it. To our melted butter, we're going to add a quarter cup of heavy cream. We're gonna add one cup of your favorite hot sauce. I'm using Frank's Red Hot to finish off this bottle. Let's give it a mix. Add a thin layer of our sauce in the bottom of our casserole dish. Take about half of what's left of your sauce and mix it in with the chicken. We're gonna grate a block of Monterey Jack cheese. I can get it open, oh my gosh. There we go. If you didn't already know this, Block cheese is number one, cheaper, and we all need that in this economy. And number two, it ha doesn't have an anti-caking agent like pre-shredded from the grocery store does, so it melts and it gets ooey gooey way more than pre-shredded cheese. Now we're gonna take about six extra large tortillas and we're gonna heat them up in the microwave for about 30 seconds just to make them more pliable and easier to roll. All right, now we're going to put a little bit of the chicken mixture in each of our tortillas and stick it in the middle so that it's easier to roll it up. I like to take the ends and fold them in, and then I'm gonna bring this piece over the chicken, pull it back towards me to tuck and roll, and then continue to push the sides in and roll until it is rolled up. We're gonna place these each seam side down in our casserole dish on top of the sauce. Now we're gonna take the remaining part of our sauce and pour it over top. And now we sprinkle on all of our cheese. And this is ready to go in the oven that is preheated for about 15 to 20 minutes until the cheese melts and the sauce is really bubbly. I mean, look at that bubbly sauce. Melty cheese. Drizzle on a little bit of homemade high protein ranch dressing. A Little bit more buffalo sauce. And top it with our chopped scallions. And this beautiful taste test time. Ten out of ten.